Okay, so we're going to make a nice simple fish dish. I know that everyone's having trouble getting shopping because of the situation with the corona. But if you look to the catering places like JJ's and that sort of thing, um, you can get really good deals on, on nice food that you can use at home. So today we're going to be using some lemon sole. I bought a case of it from there. It works out about two pound a portion. It's really cheap. Um, and you still get a nice fish. So we're going to season up some flour. I'm going to season it with a little bit of ground fennel seed with some juniper and pink peppercorns. Now you can leave it plain. You don't have to add fennel seeds, I just love them. So just a hint, and then some salt and pepper. Just give that a little mix up. Now I'll put some cauliflower in because we're going to do it with, it's going to be uh, no carbs because a friend of ours is after no carb recipes so all that is going to be a little bit of flour so we're going to do broccoli and cauliflower nice light lunch so in the pan a little bit of olive oil again use a nice one and add a little bit of butter just for flavour Soul fillets. Now I've just trimmed these up a wee bit, taking the, um, the edges off and what have you. Now we'll put it so that the skin side is up, so that your presentation side is down. Because what happens is, you know, flour gets in the butter and that and it discolours. So we want a nice clean finish to it. So we'll put it presentation side down. The other thing with these warehouses is they're very safe. You drive up, you bank your car up to them, and they put the stuff on a trolley, you take it off the trolley, so there's no contact, there's no going into a shop. It's really safe. Meanwhile, I'm just warming this pan through. I really, really love it. Just so that it's ready for the butter and the lemon to go in. Cauliflower's cooking, fish is cooking. That's all gonna take a couple of minutes. Okay, so the lemon soles are ready to flip now. They should have a nice color on them. Remember, they're only a thin fish, so they don't take a lot of cooking. There we go, they look lovely. And they're already taking on flavour. The, the, the little bit of flour on the outside is absorbing the butter and olive oil. Just taking on a little flavour to give your fish a nice bit of taste. Broccoli's had a few minutes. Um, cauliflower's had a few minutes. We're going to add the broccoli now. There's salt in the water, obviously. They're just about cooked. They don't take much cooking at all. 
So I'm going to turn those up and let them sit. They're still going to absorb a little bit of batter. Meanwhile, this is warming up. They're nearly cooked. So we'll just be another minute or so. So the vegetables are cooked, fish is cooked. In this pan, we're going to put some lovely butter. Now what we're doing is we're making nut brown butter. Which when you heat butter to a certain temperature and get it all nice and brown, it changes flavour and becomes a really wonderful thing. It has a unique nastiness to it. So we're going to let the bubbles come up and then let the bubbles go down and it should change colour at which point we'll add some fresh lemon juice. So while that's happening, start. Pop our veggies down. Now I'm going to put the fish on top of the veg because I want the batter to go down onto the veggies. As we all know, veggies love butter. There's the bubbles up. Can you see it's starting to change colour now, taking on a little bit of what the French corn was it quality, but We'll call it brown, because that's what it is. Meanwhile, on top of the um, veggies, got our lovely fishy. brown colour to it. Pass it over our fish. Now I know it looks too simple, but honestly, this is a classic set of flavours, and it really is a lovely, lovely light lunch. Thank you very much.